Alrighty guys, Jacob with JRAP Woodworking here, and as you can see, there is a box in front of the camera. A priority mail box. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, uh, anyway, this is, uh, I just got this in the mail. I placed this order last Saturday-ish, I think. I don't know. Uh, from IMA USA. It's been things I've been meaning to buy for a long time. That's my phone. Sorry about that. Uh, me things I've been wanting to buy for a long time from them. So... I'm just going to pop this box open using a Smith & Wesson and a pea knife. Really, eh, not a bad knife. It's not a good knife. It's not a bad knife. You can get it on Amazon for like 30 bucks. Anyway, let's see. This is IMA USA. And I'm surprised as to how small this box is considering what I ordered. Okay, well, so much for that. Alrighty. Let's start off with the first thing. A sling. This is a replica K98 sling I got from them for a K98, which I don't think I've made a video on. German K98, not the Yugo thing. Uh, let's see, another thing. This is an original German World War II cleaning kit. I will be buying an original German World War II sling, but I don't like using that stuff uh, on the rifle because the leather gets you know damaged. Those ones are kind of expensive, you know. So that's why I got a replica, same reason I have on my Steyr M95, which I didn't have it on the shooting video because those things cost a fortune, the original. Okay. Now this is a U.S. military bag, as you can see, and this is a Garand rifle case. I've been meaning to get one of these for a long time because I think it looks really cool taking a Garand to the range in this bad boy. And it's pretty nice and it's good for reenactments and whatnot. Packing notice and yeah, order prepared by Julie. Whoever Julie is, thank you Julie. And this is the thing I really am excited about. Replica M1 Garand ammo belt. This is, I've been really wanting one of these for a long time because I've just wanted to be able to go to the range with the ammo belt and, you know, shoot. I like the idea of just being able to, you know, uh, grab the grab the grand in the case, grab the ammo, because I, I keep the ears and stuff in the truck, ears and eyes in the truck, so just grab this, these two things and go. Range passes are in the truck, so you don't really need anything else. So that's that. Now, let's open up this cleaning kit bit more. I also need to get a cleaning rod for that, but I, I didn't, for that rifle. But I can, I'll find an original cleaning rod. Okay, opened up the wrong end. Oh boy, this thing stinks. Oh, whew, that's nice. That's really nice. Alright, let's, let's see what we have. Cleaning tools, brushes, Oil bottle, I'm guessing. I don't know. Yeah, let's go with the oil bottle. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'm not really too good with these things. But, uh, yeah. It's cool. I'll be doing a video on just this little guy once I figure out how to get half this stuff out of here. Ah. Okay, well, that thing doesn't want to come out, so I'm just going to shove it back in there. And yeah, that is that. That is the cleaning kit. Okay, whatever, I'll take care of that later. Yeah, so that's pretty much, that's the stuff. I'm really excited about this ammo belt more than anything. Anyway, so that was the video. just wanted to do a quick, quick video showing you guys this stuff. Anyway, so this is uh, Jacob with J-Rap Woodworking. If you like the video, please rate, subscribe, comment, and Jacob out. Enjoy your day.